KS Heating and Air, the team ensuring your comfort. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the afternoon edition. This is for Thursday, May 14th. I'm James Spann. Alabama's weather will stay very warm, generally dry through the weekend. An upper low could bring a little better chance of rain in here early next week, but even then, nothing too heavy. Let's check it out today. We have an upper ridge. Developing across the Gulf Coast region, the primary mid-latitude westerly shifting to the north, which happens this time of the year. Visible satellite view got a field of cumulus clouds across the state and a few little buildups near the Alabama-Mississippi state line. That was the radar composite at 212. Had a few showers, a rumble of thunder near the Mississippi state line. Uh, more extensive rain down through South Mississippi and parts of Louisiana, but most of Alabama again today rain-free. And just about everybody in the 80s, temperatures as of 215, showing Birmingham and Tuscaloosa 85, Anniston, Gadsden 82. We will stay in the 80s through the weekend. There's the watch warning map through tonight. We have a flash flood watch in effect from parts of Kansas up into northern Illinois. And in the same region, a chance of severe storms through tonight, well to the north of Alabama. That would include places like Kansas City, St. Louis, Indianapolis, and Cleveland. Tomorrow, an enhanced risk of severe weather just north and uh, west of New York City and Boston. Also got a risk of severe storms west of the state over Texas and Oklahoma, but the upper ridge kind of keeps us quiet. And on day three, which is Saturday, a marginal risk of severe storms over parts of east and south Texas. Heaviest rain north and west of Alabama for the next seven days, and around here, just not much. I do think we'll see some rain early next week. So I think we'll probably see the map filling in a little bit, but even then, probably amounts under a quarter of an inch. Tropical weather. Hurricane Center now giving that disturbance across the Florida Straits. There a 70% chance of becoming a tropical depression or storm or a subtropical depression or storm uh, by the weekend. The name will be Arthur if that happens. That will be moving northeast away from the United States, but it could bring some rough surf and rip currents to the east coast. So model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS, the 12Z run valid tomorrow at 4. Got a flat ridge here and no real change. Partly sunny, warm, maybe a few showers near the Mississippi state line. Highs will likely be in the low to mid 80s. Saturday as the weekend begins. Pretty decent amount of sunshine, mid to upper 80s. The day should be dry and Sunday. Again, maybe some rain just west of the state. Uh, the day Sunday dry highs well up in the 80s. And a surface front will be pushing in here Sunday night and Monday. This is Monday. A surface low is located south of Indianapolis and west of Louisville. And this is suggesting a chance of showers Sunday night or Monday. And again, this is not a big rain event, but we'll take whatever we can get. It's only rained on one day in the month of May so far. And on that day, we had less than a tenth of an inch. It was getting dry here. And this is Tuesday, a very deep upper low sitting on top of the southeastern states. And if that's the case, it will be noticeably cooler on Tuesday. If this verifies, highs only in the low to mid-70s. We'll have to back things off a good bit with clouds and maybe some patchy light rain under that feature. Wednesday, pretty much the same thing. Highs in the 70s, maybe some light rain. And a week from today, Thursday, May 21st, the upper low beginning to lift out, and that looks dry with highs in the low 80s. Let's go out 10 days. This is Sunday, May 24th. Again, the main wave action well to the north, and there could be a few showers, but nothing too heavy. Rain for Birmingham for the next 15 days off the GFS Ensemble. The mean under one inch. And temperatures, you can see that cool down next week. National blend of models showing 78 for Birmingham on Tuesday, but then we go right back up toward 92 on Sunday, May 24th. And the brand new CPC Outlook, May 22nd through May 29th, showing once again, above average temperatures for much of the eastern half of the country. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this afternoon. We'll have notes in the blog. The next video here by 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. You can catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great evening and God bless.
Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today.